Yeah. Good morning guys, today you join me with my good mate Joe. We're going to be doing some lure fishing and we've got two stretches of water lined up to be fishing today. Uh, we're going to be starting off here. We know there's pike in this particular stretch and the upper stretch so we're hoping that we are going to be into some action. Now Joe's only just started doing some lure fishing this winter so the idea of today's session is going to be getting his, his first lure called pike. Our conditions are looking pretty good it's not too windy and the water clarity is actually pretty good so i'm, I'm hopeful that the the lures are going to do the trick today so we're going to start off this stretch and then we'll see how we get on I do like this Savage Gear jerking play, it's definitely one of my favourite lures. You can fish it in so many different styles and it still performs really well. Fishing it really fast and then having a good pause, letting that just sit in the water. It's a slow slinking lure so it doesn't sink too fast especially where it's, there's a lot of weed growth here, especially in along the margins. Just gives it that extra time, just like pike to make up its mind and absolutely smack it. Yes, oh, it's come off. It felt the hooks, definitely. I just couldn't, I just couldn't set the hooks. Goodbye, cool. That is weird. <laughs> That's the weirdest plant I have ever seen growing on the bottom of a river. <laughs> it does look like a pineapple, doesn't it? I'm in. I'm in. Oh, it's let go. Come off again. Don't believe it. That's two. Took it on the drop again. Or on the pool, sorry. Two quick bursts with the real handle and then a couple of seconds pulls and it I felt the hit on the pulls.
I reckon we try that again. I've had two hits from down there. If you want to, we head, then head to the car. But this Savage Gear Jerk is definitely the lure that they're sort of honed in for. I think it's just because I can fish it slow. I think what we're going to do is we're going to head on to the next stretch, have a cup of tea at the car in a moment, have some lunch. And we'll head on to the next stretch because since those two bites that we had earlier, we actually haven't even seen a sign of enough of pike yet, so we'll keep on the move. Just got to the second stretch, as you can see just behind me, Joe's already fishing, and it's actually looking really good. It's a lot wider than the stretch we were fishing earlier. Um, there's also a couple of match fishermen fishing just uh, down the bank from us. Um, and conditions are looking pretty good, so we're hopeful that we're gonna get into a pike in the next hour or so. We're gonna give it enough hour and a half something like that and then we're going to probably head on call it a day but fingers crossed we can get ourselves into a pike. bit um, precarious. Yeah, I love how this lure looks through the water. I'm in a couple of minds whether to change the lure, but I feel like because this has already got me two, two bites, I think it's got a bit of confidence in it. Well, I'm hoping we're going to get enough of a shot of a, a pike before we have to call it a day. The rain is starting to come in, starting to drizzle. I think we're probably going to give it enough of 20 minutes, half an hour, and I think we're going to knock it on the head. Unfortunately, it's looking like it is going to be a blank after losing those two fish earlier in quick succession. But that's fishing. Certainly give it our best go at catching, catching one before we call it a day. Last cast. Well, the rain has started to come in, so me and Joe have decided to knock it on the head. Unfortunately, um, it is gonna be a blank. We lost those two pike earlier on that Savage Gear 4 play um, jerk bait, but it's been a good day. I mean, I'll definitely be back down here with hopefully the dead baits and even again with the lures. Um, I want to go back to the first stretch and see if we can uh, get ourselves a pike at some point in the next, next month or so would be good. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you next time.